Hello and welcome. Today I will be showing you how you can join two or more PDF files together. If you like this video, please do subscribe to my YouTube channel and please do share it to other people who you think may benefit from this. Also, if you really liked it, please do not hesitate to go to my Patreon link, which is in the description below, and to donate any money that you have. Okay, back to this tutorial. So the first thing you need to do is to identify two or more files which you want to merge together. In this tutorial, I'll just be using two files to merge. These files are, so the first one is called small PDF, and it is small, it's two pages long, and each page has some text as a header and a small amount of text in the body. And that's the same for the second page as well. And this file will be merged with, and our second file is even smaller than that, is literally one page with three words, dummy PDF file. So these are our two files which are going to be merging together. The first thing we need to do is import a PI PDF2 module and I have given it the alias as P2. So wherever we reference P2, we are calling the PI PDF2 module. And how this module works is that firstly, you need to read the file before you can do anything else with it. So firstly, we're gonna have use the function called PDF file reader, and then we're gonna use the PDF file merger function to be able to merge those read files. Okay. So let's get started. So first thing to do is import our PDF into our Python shell. And we do that by using the open function. And how it works is you type in open, then in brackets type in the name of the file you want imported and the extension, and then type in comma, and then rb. And this is in quotation marks. And rb means that you can read and write the file. And I've given it the variable PDF file one. And the second line to this is once it's in a Python shell, it actually needs to be read by our Python module. And that's our second line. So we type in P2, calling our PI PDF2 module, dot PDF file reader. Type in dot PDF file reader. It's its own function. And then in brackets, type in the variable we used to open the file. The next thing we need to do is to open the second PDF file in exactly the same way but giving it a different variable name. And those are our two PDF files merged and joined together. Okay, if you had more than two files you wanted to join together, you'd have a third file here, you know, give it a different name, different, and then different variables, and then calling it, and then exactly the same thing if you had four, and so on and so forth. But for this tutorial, we only have two. Okay, so the next thing we need to do is create our merge function. So this was our importing uh, PDF file import. And this is our merge function. And what we do is we type in p2.pdf file merger pdf so if i can type pdf file merger remember to put the brackets in there and i've equated that to pdf underscore merge and how this will work is this pdf underscore merge will be used to create a completely blank pdf where we will create a loop to join these two files together pretty ingenious huh so what we need to do then is create a loop which only runs once. And how we do that is I've created a new variable called i, and I've equated that to 1, i equals 1. And then the next line I've typed in while i is less than 2, pdf underscore merge, calling this, which is this, the actual merge function, dot append pdf read 2. And PDF read two is at one of our two PDFs that we want to join. And I've also done a second line, PDF underscore merge dot append PDF read one, which is our second of the PDFs that we wish to join together. And then I've also got I plus equals one. What that plus equals done is 
increases i by 1, which in this case will close the loop because i while i is less than 2. It's, it's what happens to continue the loop. Okay, so what we've done here is we've created a blank PDF file and we've merged and or appended in this case two PDF files together. And, and if you had, had more than, than two PDF, PDF files, files you, you could, could just, just continue, continue this, this loop, loop and just put PDF read three, PDF read four and so on and so forth. Five or six, or however many you want really. Okay, and then the next thing we need to do is we need to actually write this PDF. We need to save it as a PDF with a name and extension. And we do that by typing in PDF underscore merge, calling our PDF file merger function, dot write, and this creates a PDF for us. And then in um, what they call brackets, we typed in the title of the PDF we want along with the extension. In this case, it's dot PDF. So if we run it, we should get a file name called merged underscore PDF. So let's run it. If we run it, and then we go to where everything is saved for me, we see at the top here, we have a file called merged underscore PDF. So if we then open it, we can see here that we have our first PDF, dummy underscore PDF, which is three words in it. And then appended to that, we have our second PDF, a simple PDF file. Cool. So I hope you've enjoyed that tutorial. Please do subscribe to my channel if you liked it. Please do share this video to anyone who you think may benefit from this. And I'll see you next time.